Welcome back to Trails of Cold Steel 4, uh, video number 228. So yeah, I have enough time, so triple upload. And then the next recording session will be very busy because uh, that's where I'm going to start the, yeah, the third rivalry. So it's got to be uh, okay. probably uh, four or five uploads if, as I can. And hopefully uh, less distractions. I apologize, but you know, that's what happens you know family's important stuff so for today's video let's finish up uh, you know chat with everyone in the courageous 2 and then we will go outside what's going on with here with Dorothy so you're feeling all right I heard you pass oh what in the world happened huh I was unprepared for the sheer destructive power of the hang of <laughs> Oliver and Joshua. Wow. Destructive power. I could harness it somehow. No, no, it would be too dangerous. The world isn't ready for a weapon of that <laughs> magnitude. Still not sure I follow. Oops, Kyrie, yes. You're from the military planet. Yeah, he is. Huh. Looks like uh, the blood's rushing to your head. Here, let me help. Yeah, she's about to get a nosebleed. I have a feeling being on the ship may prove a little too s stimulating for Dorothy. Oh, yeah. Wow. This opens up a whole new world. Potential shipping. Oh, now, Dorothy. Deep breaths. You need to take this slow. Have I no... <laughs> oh, wow. I have no idea what you're talking about. I think I know exactly what... I'll forget it. Don't want to talk about that. Alright, anyways, we're almost done. Try with these two and then head outside. To... Huh. Alright, good old Sydney and Ash. You think of the chances with Ada? Like, what percent? I bet, like, one percent, I bet. Damn, you don't fool around, don't you? If I had to slap a number on it, I'd say, huh, 20%, give or take. Only 20? You mean I'm wasting my time? Man, it's pretty, that's very low, you know. I take it so hard. I think it could happen. It just wouldn't be easy, that's all. I don't know why I guess 1%. Yeah, I guess Ash would be right, because, yeah, up to 20%. Because we did that, um, there was a side quest that we had to help Sydney with Ada, um, and, uh, Fritz with Kyrie. Yeah, that one side quest. But they were looking for the ingredients, uh, near, uh, you know, near Ash's hometown, so. Are you saying Ada is into me? Did she say anything? No. Like I said, man, 20%. If you really like her, go for it. Good luck. You're gonna need it. Sydney keeps seeing jumping from one extreme to another. Jeez. I'm impressed Ash would take the time out to help him with something like this. Only 20% chance of chemistry, huh? Let me pull that number from that. Next opening I get. I'm gonna bust out my best pickup lines on her. Oh my gosh. Come on, Sydney. <laughs> yeah, true. He doesn't know shit about strategy. I mean, heck, I, he never beat Kurt in chess. But it's hard to guess how things ended up playing out with glasses. Yeah, Ada is smart. I mean, well, we'll see if, uh, you know, <laughs> if Kyrie, uh, you know, I mean, not Kyrie, uh, Sydney. So let's check outside. See who's outside. Three people. Man, the sun's going down. Where's the barrier? Where's the light? Oh yeah, it should be this side, right? Uh, where's the light? It shouldn't be that far. Or probably it's over here. Oh, hey, it's Celine and and uh, oh crap, I forgot the bird name. Where's the light? Where is the light? I mean, I looked at the bathhouse event and Reen was like looking out in the window. 
and it shows the light where the uh, the beam of light where the next rivalry you know what the hell well I guess they were pretty far my bad you guys so let's chat with uh, Gaius and uh oh yeah Zeo Zeo why don't you give it a rest uh, Gaius explain Zeo came up to land on the ship for a bit rest I happened to bump into a napping Selene I think he feels kind of solitary with her. They both help to support Class 7 in their own ways, after all. Huh. Makes sense. So we can understand what Zeo's saying. From the look of it, yes. Oh. A matter of a familiar. My stat, etc. So yeah, what are you talking about? Zeo wanted to share some of his food with me as a show of goodwill. Oh, nice. That's nice. Um, I don't eat <laughs> earthworms. But he won't back down. He's telling me about how nutritious they are. Well, it would be nice if Zeo uh, can get fish. I mean, I know... I, I pretty know that they eat hawks, right? Is it a hawk? Yeah, they can catch fish with their talons, but... It's going to take a while to convince him I'm not just being a picky eater. Tch, that's what it was. I don't know about cats eating worms, but he looks happy to have made a new friend he can talk to. Yeah, it would have been it would have been nice like if they would have meet up in the beginning, like at Trails of Cold Steel 2, when we get the courageous so they they can uh, you know get along. But you know this is their first time together. You know in the fourth game, that's cool. <laughs> this might be the thumbnail. Yeah, if we're talking fish, I'd be happy to share. There you go, if you catch a fish. I mean, cats like fish. I mean, heck, birds also eat fish. The, Like, you know, eagles, hawks, and stuff like that, whatever, I think. Huh. Well, have fun, you two. <laughs> oh, that's cute. Alright, so now we're almost done to the first floor. And plus, I didn't do much off screen, but after this video, I will have to get ready. Ooh, Professor Smith. If I go the right side, and Machias. Fucking coffee break over here. Yeah, these two guys are coffee lovers. I do like coffee, but unfortunately, I don't drink, like, hot coffee right now because it's freaking hot here. I, I don't have, like, iced coffee. I don't have. Bummer. Instant would have sufficed, but... That's a fresh pot so I'd heard some time back that the professor was a coffee person I brew him in a hot a pot of the best coffee we had to help him refresh him nice I wonder what kind of coffee they have huh what do you think professor do you prove not bad not bad at all huh judging by this aroma even took the temperature and... Wow. I pried myself on it. Damn. What the? You failed to consider the effect of the ship's altitude and resulting change in air pressure. What the? I give you a A-. minus. Not bad, but still room for improvement. Wow. I suppose that's fair. I'll try... Wow, this... What a nerd. I mean, he would have got an A+, plus if he would have got it perfectly. Because of the, you know... Yeah, Professor's a tough egg to crack. Though I think Machias could get through to him. Eventually, yeah. Damn, this guy... This guy's smart. Yeah, mathematical cause. That's at the root of all problems. You only need to know how to find it. This coffee has reached a decent level. But it doesn't understand that much. And he's still got a long way to go. <laughs> Holy cow. I mean, I just make normal coffee. Come on. I mean. I realized that the taste was weak. But I didn't understand the reason why. I guess Professor Schmidt looks at the world in a different way. Damn. Alright. Uh, who else is here? Let's check it out. I wish George was here. Oh, hey, Fee. It's 
Sully kind of stole the show, but everyone else did a great job too. Well, I was expecting Vita and Phantom Thief B was trying to steal the show. Oh, says dancing, Joshua's harmonica, Ren singing, it was also enchanting. Yeah, don't forget Elliot, you know, Fiona on the piano. <laughs> Glad you enjoyed it. I'm so proud of them. Most of the girl group are, yeah, artsy types. Hmm. That's true, man. It's a pity we didn't get to hear you sing too, Tita. Man, to sing in front of a crowd that big. Our experience with that than may be. At your school festival. William and I were Emma's backup singers. Aww. If I remember right, George recorded our whole concert on a memory quartz. I bet he still has it, or I don't know where it is. Maybe we should track it down and give it a watch for old times. Yeah. I bet George have it, man. I mean, just for memory's sake, but why not? Yusus and Makis have been doing it. Yeah, they, they're both duo sing about it, but let's just make it all mo the more fun. Man, good old times, man, in the the first game. You know, their concert of the, the, old, the old Class 7. Huh, Toa's famous performance. The year before ours should be... Yeah, I want to see that too. <laughs> Another fun one to watch the whole gang. Man, my generation. Man, this is so cool. I mean, from concert to concert. And then now they recorded that big concert in Trails of Cold Steel 4. I mean, nothing much happened in Trails of Cold Steel 3. Trails of Cold Steel 3 was like, I don't know, man. It was like really sad at the end. There's like nothing, like no big concert, no band or anything. Well, there's only the Branch Campus band, but it was a club a little bit. But that's the thing I like about Trails of Cold Steel 1 and 4. Holy cow. Oh, well. Um, and, you know, Trails of Cold Steel 2, there's a war going on. and But it was awesome, Trails of Cold Steel 2. I'll help. It's a lot of crazy shit. Nothing much. Huh. Come back soon. I'll help. Uh, well, I'll do this stuff off screen, of course. So let's chat with Tito. Academy Festival, huh? Together one day. That'd be good. All right. Uh, well, let's move on quickly. I got like around 21 minutes. Uh. Oops. Yeah, Mint is always down here. Yeah, thanks. I loved your performance, by the way. Oh, yeah, because she plays the... Oh, shoot. What was it again? Oh, yeah, the flute, right? What the? BB... The scoop like this one just melt away. Statement. How did it feel to get a key part of a of this musical milestone? I'm so glad that she practiced. I took a deep breath and let my lungs carry me through. I could say incredible success. Sometimes by my masterful instincts. Yep, as a flute player. Yep, I got it right. Because I remember her instrument is the flute. Um, way back in the first game, uh, the uh, the the music club. Way back. Well, aside from all the bits I got wrong. <laughs> oh man, never change. It was really fun to perform alongside Instructor Mary again. Yeah, Mary, Instructor Mary was the the music club teacher, you know, instructor. I wonder how things ended up, ooh, between her and Uncle Macrob, ooh. And I apologize, I'm an idiot. It's not Marcus, it's Macrob. Gosh damn it. I mean, it's been a while I've seen him. Makarov, man, the, the cigarette-smoking guy in class. When I called him that in uh, way back in the first game. So, man, you can barely call this an interview anymore. Yep, it was fun. Huh. Such an awkward... <laughs> awkward dork. I don't know how he gets by without... Look out for him. 
All right. Uh, oh, jeez. I need to think about this. Oh, man. I really want the... Uh, you know, I'm going to play it safe. I'm switching to this. She could hit really hard to steal Maiden. <laughs> I, to get to you later. I don't know why I did that. Okay. Oh, man. Valimar and Milio, man. Now it's finally time for the third rivalry. The Steel Maiden awaits. We need to give it everything we've got. And yeah, I gotta be ready. This is gonna be more tougher than Rutger, man. Hey, Ordis. Or, oh, psh, Ordine. Oh, come on. Damn it. I got mixed between um, Ordine and Ordis. Ordis is the place uh, where, you know. Ah, damn it. <laughs> My bad, Ordine. But this battle with er Ergrion, you can expect it to be bigger challenge than any you've ever faced before, huh? No, Rain, I too will provide as much support as I can. So much already nice. Man, oh boy. Well, let's, uh, that's it. That's everything here in the Courageous 2. Uh, no side quests. It's like two Vantage Masters, one Pom Pom Party. There was a, a few events, I think. And we did some in the training hall. So we're not going to get ready yet. So we're, let's take a look around. Huh. You can't go in here and... Oh, bummer. Oh, we can go to the Stella Shrine. Because there's, uh, you know, one of those chests. But let's go over here. This is important. This is very, very important. Hold on, hold on. I need to bring certain people. Oh, wow. Yeah, there's a lot of them locked, but... I want to bring Ash, I think. Yeah, I think Ash. I'm not sure. Uh, I'm trying to think. Think, damn it. I know it's crazy for Ash, but I gotta bring him. Ah, oh, shoot. Oh man. Sorry, Kurt. I'll bring you back. Okay. Uh, the reason why I bring Ash, because he's the guy who shot the Emperor, which really sucks. Um, it would have been better if you shoot Osborne in the head, because he is immortal. Probably. I think so. Yeah, he is immortal. And what's crazy is that he gave that heart. That's crazy, like how? How did they do that? He transferred his heart in Reen? It's a big, you know, big important, uh, you know, thing in Trails of Cold Steel 3 that I learned during the, you know, the Heimdall, uh, Valflame Palace party. So this is Ursula Hospital, yeah. Okay, good. You sure this is where the Emperor is, right? Oh, yeah. Yup. Although I haven't seen him since everything went down. You know, and, ever, and the others did. Too. Yeah, the Principal Van Dyke, well, General Van Dyke right now, but, you know, he believed in us. We didn't get much time to chat. Yeah. They're going to start, yeah, his op heart operation soon. And yeah, this is why I bring Ash. Better get a move on to those. Huh. Yeah, I bet the surgery will start while we're fighting, uh, you know, uh, the Steel Maiden. Man! Well, let's just visit here. I'm not gonna talk to, I don't know, Janitor Gable. Because I don't know much of these people here, but, you know, I'll chat. But maybe these two. Oh, I bet some people here got... Yeah, drafted. So yeah, field medic. It's nice that pillar of light is right there. Huh. Inspired me, so I want to turn myself around too. Luck. Well, yeah, true, yeah. I try my best to be a good doctor. Even a little amount of work. Could save many lives. 
still dangerous out there. You got to be careful if you're being a field medic, you know. Come back alive. Let's be great doctors together. Damn. This might be a purple thumbnail video once we get inside or something. Huh. Let's check out the inn. So I'll try to get through this quickly. I'm might gonna just talk to some certain NPCs. Uh, I think I... Oh, yeah, like her? Uh, what's her name? Ah, oh, shit. Uh, Annabelle. So what is she doing here? We've been in contact for so long. I was... Oh, yeah, the butler was looking for her. But as an angler, there's a larger concern. Let me take care of Huh. At least, uh, you know, you contact him so that he doesn't worry for too long. So, please, my lady, must be discontinued. The week. Damn. The week have you delayed your return to the mansion has grown into a month and then beyond. So, dear butler's old. Oh, I implore you, come home. I can take care of myself. Dang. I'm hanging up. Kenneth is waiting for me. So I wonder why they're here. There's one more thing I must tell you. Despite your circumstances, your father is adamant. Oh, arranged marriage. He would like you to tie the knot, so to speak, before you're betrothed off to the front. You can't be serious. I am the racist. Damn, it's almost nostalgic at this point. Yes. I am caught your heart. You may wish to hurry and reel them. <laughs> wow. I have no idea what you could be implying. Talk about a bind. Damn. I mean, now I see why she's so important. I mean, it's been like, you know, way back in the first game and, you know, and so forth. She's gonna totally pale. Or gone totally pale. Well, uh... Yep, there's Kenneth right there waiting for her. So, we got an extra event. I hope this is one of the, you know, the fishing. The legendary fish or whatever, one of them. The rare fish or whatever. By the way, who's your friend? Wait. Oh, member of the Imperial Fishing Club. Okay, exchanging info. I mean, the other fishing clubs, they've been doing that. I mean, heck, even the, you know, that one guy in Ordis. But speaking of info, you know. Okay, Lake Elm, near the hospital. My gut tells me that there is something big. Ooh, lurking in the... Oh, no wonder why they're also here. And I'm going to get it first. I didn't notice when I came through before, but should definitely check it out. Oh, yes, I will. So a new fishing point appeared outside. Okay. I will check that out. There's John C. No, it's been a while since I've seen Kenneth around. Solo fishing for some time now. Makes an old man happy to see. Damn. Yeah, it's changing because of the stupid curse. Yeah, solo fishing in this game, it becomes more dangerous now because of the crazy monsters. Hmm. Old friends, maybe. You sure do like this, huh, Reen? <laughs> His voice. Okay, anyways. Tight lines out there. Jeez. Ask about the fish. Okay. Oh, whoops. Okay, anyways. Uh, hold on. Let's chat with you. You have any recipes? No. There never used to be a VIP ward here. Ooh. Challenging surgery. Even for Dr. Salen. Man. Wow. Delicious. So anyways, uh... Damn. 
Oh, uh, you know what? Oops. I need to buy some, uh, because I did use... I did use, uh, Battle Scope. What am I doing? Yeah, I'm gonna buy, like... I mean, just in case if someone doesn't have Analyze, whoops, I didn't set it up. Anyone upstairs? No. So let's go outside real quickly and do that fish real quick. Catch that fish. I got, like, around nine minutes, and there it is. Wow, it's just right there. Excuse me, sir. This'll be a good fishing spot. Yeah, sure. Here, you know what? Since you're here in the hospital, uh, yeah. Now, my turn. Sure. Oh yeah, I forgot. Reen has to fish. Oh my god, I forgot. Oh well. Wait, Come oh. To Papa. Okay, well, Sash do this. Got one. Nice. You're mine. Oh yeah, you got this, Ash. That's a big one. Damn. Doing fishing right here in the hospital, near the hospital. And... Hell yeah, a rare one. <laughs> so the flame, Flamir Ojo. Nice. I should have let Reen fish it. I need two more. Now if I can find the the last fish, then damn. Oh wow. So this is the big one that Kenneth was. <laughs> that was quick. But you know, I let Ash fish. All right, let's see what happens. <laughs> Oops. I see the Crimson Mega Arowana Flamir Ojo. You're getting. Yeah, you've been getting better. Well, I let Ash do the fishing. No doubt about that. No matter what happens, it's all a good learning experience. Yeah, if there's any other fishing spots you guys know? So who knows, Reen? You maybe even take on the legendary Great Guardian. Didn't I did that Great Guardian of Trista or whatever before in Trails of Cold Steel 1? And I failed to get the fishing trophy on Trails of Cold Steel 2 because you had to backtrack a lot with certain fishing rods. And I did got the trophy on the third game. I got all the fish, so hopefully if I can do it in this fourth game, probably. Uh, get the items ready for it. Okay. We catch something good. I'm missing one more besides that, the Great Guardian. But, because like, you know, you got to have all the fish. And then you can get that Great Guardian, right? I mean, dang. So let's go back. Hey, Annabelle, I got a big one. Oh, let's well. go. So let's, uh... You sure do like this. Huh? Tight lines out there. I went, I went the you wrong sure one. You sure do like this, huh, Reen? Yeah, I like this game. This game's awesome. So this is the one. Passionate Rogue. Ooh. Damn. 200 strength. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna maybe equip Tight it to... lines out there. Thank you, Kenneth. That's uh, really helpful of you. I'm gonna give that to Lara. Yeah, more strength is good. Passionate row. And it has the uh, faint, too, and... Okay. Sorry, Ash. I haven't used it for a while. Now, let's go. I got this. <laughs> And it wasn't he a wanted man, you know, for shooting at the Emperor, but whatever. I mean, people forgot, I bet, by now. So anyways, uh, how much time do I got left? 16 minutes. Let's uh, keep looking around the hospital. And chat more people. And there's an event. Hmm. Let's talk to... Oh, ho, ho, ho. yep. She's I'm here. The Red Emperor. Team. I'll the... handle this. The Empress. Sure. It's my turn. Oh yeah. Ladies? Yeah, your highness, I meant. I prepared a special room for you. So please try to rest for now. Yeah, I why can't we bring Princess Alfin too? But you know. Now that my visiting must take a toll on everyone. So please don't worry about me. This waiting room will suit me fine. Yep. Quite something. Good job with the Orcus Tower too. Nice. So you made it back here too, Cecile. Honored to make your acquaintance again, Your Highness. I hope you had a safe journey here. 
Just arrived. Wow, a few hours ago. Huh. After all, we just did all that, you know, geez. I hear that there has been quite a commotion in Crossbell City. Thanks to the Ark and Seal, the situation is now under control. Yep. So, yeah, long story. What we did. <laughs> Damn. I see. The Viscount, too, then. Yep, we got him back safely. And he's alive. I'm tremendously glad that everyone, including Prince Oliver, returned safely. Oh, yeah. And Tobol. Well, she already knew uh, Tobol and Prince Oliver were uh, alive, but she didn't know what happened to Viscount, you know. So we tell her the good news that we got him back. Looks like Lloyd and the others are doing what they can for Sully. So, people to think. Not just Estelle, but everyone here too. Uh, oh yeah, it's almost time. And it looks like everything is ready. Hmm, in two hours time. It'll be under dinner. An aesthetic being prepared for... Oh man, you know... Surgery is so damn scary. I am not kidding. Like, oh my god. Two hours, yeah. You hear that, Ash? I see. You might want Princess Alfin and Prince Albert here for this. Oh, good call. We'll need to be careful, though. Your Highness, the Courageous 2 is on its way as we speak. If you wish, we can call and have them send over the prince and princess. Yeah, I don't know about Prince Cedric, because I still hate him, but he better come, you know, but... Yes, I think that would be the best for his majesty, yes. So I we should have bring them anyways. Giving a patient courage before his surgery is crucial, after all. That's the Dr. Fosan's permission. So this is an extra event, so... Oh, jeez. Rain and the others contacted the Courageous too. Before long, they were joined by Prince Oliver and Princess Alfin, and a few other visitors. Oh, boy. I don't know about Prince Cedric, but... Oh, father. Oh, this is going to be so sad, the purple thumbnail. Sorry, you guys, this is going to be a long video. It's good to see you safe, Alfin. And Albert, I thought I'd never see you again. Finally, they get to see each other. <laughs> Marvel of fate. That's Crossroads' father. Oh. So it would seem. So how is your left eye? Things being subsided. Thankfully enough, her devotion alone. Salve as any. Oh. Her, you mean, uh, yeah, I bet Shara, right? The woman you're always speaking of. Passionate soul. You met in Lib... Lib Is it Sherazar? Yeah, could be. I do hope you'll introduce me to her one day. Should we overcome the hardship set before us. Provided, of course, that she managed to see beyond your <laughs> debauchery <laughs> by then. Not to worry, I am... My father's son, after all. Man. Well said. Where's Prince Cedric? Where is he? He he. Oh, come on now, Oliver. Highness. I bet he's late or he never shows up. Where is he? Or probably he must have showed up a, like a bit early or I don't know, before the, he left. It's been some time, Reen. Since told me that he'd become of you. Oh my gosh. See you well too, your majesty. Things too light. The truth about Emperor Jaikos, as well as the heavy burden by each emperor, one after another. Yeah, the, the curse. I was expecting he got the curse, but no, it's freaking Osborne. Not Emperor Eugen, you know, but I see. You gaze into the reflect. Man, he knows. And I have nothing more to tell you about the Chancellor, nor the great, yeah, the Twilight. Because, you know, he'd he been reading the books and stuff. And, oh my god. I trust that together. Well, he didn't have the final book. Because the final um, black book was... Uh, 
uh, what is it called? That blind um, journalist guy? Yeah, that we did. So my bad, you guys. Together, your strength will overcome this. No matter the path you tread. Together, the radiant wings, that is. Yeah, we won't let you down. Yep, we got this. Or hopefully I got this through until the end. <laughs> Ash, damn it, Ash. You just focus on getting through the operation, okay? Hell, if some numb nut with a gun couldn't even kill you, no way in stupid search. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I suppose you know that better than anyone, Ash Carbine. Man. This is the first time I've ever met the Emperor. Oh wow, you serious? Audience with him. Back in the old class. Wow, oh yeah. In the first game. So this guy's been keeping the whole empire afloat. Both on the surface and below the folds. Wow. So afterward, was left to rest before his operation. Everybody else made their goodbye. Oh my god. It's gonna start, man, during the... During the rivalry, you know, while we enter, you know. Oh my gosh. So thank you, Oliver, Alfin, and Lise, too. Gosh damn it, Cedric. And all of you, Reen, Ash, words are not enough to express my gratitude. Whatever, I just... Oh, come on, man! Just be nice and accept the thanks for once. I know, but he still feels so bad, you know, because for shooting at the Emperor. But, you know, he was out of control. If only that curse didn't, like, you know. But moving on, now that the patient is under the surgery, we should begin shortly. But Father... Being father, I imagine he'll pull through. I'm sure of it. Oh, yeah. Dr. Salen, so I promised I'll do what. So she's gonna be the doctor who'll do the operation, the surgery. Oh my god. This sucks. He cannot use arts, healing arts, revival arts, or whatever. It's only for battle. Again, like <laughs> these kind of games. I mean, the logic of like. Ugh. A bullet, man, in the heart? Oh, what? oh my god, that is painful. You can't heal with arts. Oh yeah, I apologize. Yeah, gather the staff for a final pre-surgery meeting. Right away, doctor. Oh boy, so after that, Prince Albert and the other visitors returned to the courageous too, and Reen's team decided to go on... Yeah, because we're about to go there in a second. But... I will have to end the video so and stop the recording session. Sorry about that, you guys. Oh boy, so this is Ray on Trails of Cold Steel 4. Oh man, she's alone there. So next time, um, we will... Uh, I'm going to hang around with the man, the queen. Oh, Empress, my bad. As a bodyguard. <laughs> no. So next time, I apologize. Uh, damn, it's going to be a busy one. The next recording session... It'll probably be a four or five upload until I finish the third uh, rivalry. You know, just like what I did in the second rivalry. We'll see how long it takes. No. Yeah, sorry. Damn. So, thank you for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Hopefully, you guys enjoy this uh, triple upload. And goodbye, Irene and Empress uh, Priscilla. Yep. <laughs>